The 2007 to 2012 Audi TT. The history of the TT Tourist Trophy started in 1995 when Audi unveiled the first concept at the 1995 Frankfurt Motor Show. It would be a full three years before the market would be introduced to the production model in 1998, but when that happened, it arrived in both coupe and roadster versions. The first generation remained active until 2006, when the company released the second generation TT for the 2007 MY. Compared to the first generation TT, the model unveiled in 2006 featured a completely redesigned exterior, a switch from the Volkswagen Group PQ34 platform to the PQ35, and new, improved engines. At the launch, the TT MK2 was offered with a choice of two inline four-cylinder engines and a V6 carried over from the previous model, but in the years that have followed since then, Audi has enriched the lineup with even more engine choices to satisfy the market. For the most part, the second-generation TT has remained unchanged, but the past couples of years have brought on some tweaks to freshen up the car's look. In 2011, the TT was given a more powerful bumper, larger air inlets with three-dimensional, sharp edges, and fog lights set in chrome rings. Under the hood, Audi placed new technologies that allowed improved fuel consumption. For 2012, Audi has decided to offer the TTRS version on the US market, which is enough of a change to warrant some attention. Hit the jump to read more about the Audi TT. Exterior 2007 to 2010 models Compared to the first generation, the second gen Audi TT was 5.4 in. Longer and 3.1 in. Wider, but only 0.2 in. Higher. The body was constructed of a lightweight Audi space frame design that also allows it to be lighter than the model it replaced. The 2006 Audi TT continued the motif of circles and domes launched by the first TT, but appeared more stretched with pure geometric lines. It came sporting a single-frame radiator grille with large air inlets and sharply cut, sloping headlights in the front and wide wheel arches, rear lights that generated a three-dimensional effect thanks to their visual depth, powerful exhaust tailpipes, a wide diffuser, and centered rear fog lights at the rear. The second-generation Audi TT was also given an electrically operated rear spoiler that activated only when the car reached a speed of 75 miles per hour. When the car's speed dropped below 50 miles per hour again, the spoiler would automatically retract. 2011-2012 models For the 2011 model year, the TT got a little facelift to keep with the times. Changes included a more powerful bumper, which frames the larger air inlets with three-dimensional, sharply drawn-out edges. The single-frame grille is now painted in high-gloss black and the headlights received optional xenon lights. For the daytime running lights, Audiofer's 12 white LEDs arranged in a straight line at the lower edge of the headlights, a classic Audi design feature. Dimensions Wheels choices 19-inch tri-spoke 5-segment design aluminum alloy wheels with summer performance tires 9JX19, tires 255-35RR19Y, 18-inch 5-arm dynamic design aluminum alloy wheels with summer performance tires, 9JX18, tires 245-40RR1893Y, 18-inch 5-arm dynamic design aluminum alloy wheels all-season self-supporting run-flat tires SST 93H 18-inch 7-arm dynamic design aluminum alloy wheels with all-season self-supporting run-flat tires SST 9JX18 tires 245/40RR1893H 18-inch 10-spoke aluminum alloy wheels with summer performance tires, 9JX18 and 245-40ths, R1893Y 19-inch 7-twin-spoke design wheels with summer performance tires, 9JX19, tires 255-35ths-R19Y Interior The Audi TT's interior continues the same fluid dynamism of the exterior. Classic elements of the TT models are the three center air vents and the instrument cluster with its two large scales for speed and revs. Compared to the first generation, the new TT received a larger digital speedometer in the display of the driver information system. 
The steering wheel was trimmed in high-grade Napa leather and flattened at the bottom, similar to the Le Mans Quattro sports car study. Both driver and passenger sports seats were fitted even lower down than in the car's predecessor, providing a truly sporty seating position. 2011 facelift Along with the exterior changes made to the TT during its 2011 facelift were tweaks to the interior, including new aluminum look applications on the steering wheel, the center console, and in the door liner. This sporty feeling was combined with rings, frames, and strips in high-gloss black. The aluminum strip above the glove box door was covered in brushed gray, but customers could choose between three new interior colors, nougat brown, titanium gray, and garnet red. The leather seat covers were specially treated to reduce thermal heating by as much as 68 degrees Fahrenheit when the TT was parked in the sun. Navigation and audio Audi MMI navigation plus with 6-disc CD changer Real-time traffic, including one-time subscription of four years Audi MMI operating logic 6.5 TFT color display in dash CD player for navigation DVD or audio, MP3 CD. Navigation DVD for US and Canada including Hawaii, not Alaska. Two SD card inserts to play MP3 audio data, music. AM, FM, SAT radio with channel preset capability. Phase diversity, improved reception for both AM and FM bands. RDS radio data system displays radio station call letters and other information. Theft deterrent design. Gala graduated audio level adjustment varies volume based on vehicle speed. Five language settings and voice guidance English, French, Spanish are customer selectable Italian, German need to be programmed by dealer. Bose sound system with audio pilot. 12 speakers INCL. Center speaker and subwoofer and total output of 255 watts. 1 2 by 4.25 inch mid high range center fill speaker in instrument panel. 2 1 inch tweeters, one on each of the instrument panel. 2 3 inch neodymium mid range speakers, one in each door. 2 8 inch neodymium woofers, one in each door. 2 1 inch tweeters in the rear firewall. Two 6.5-inch low, mid-range speakers in the firewall. One 5.25-inch rich base woofer in a customized 9.4-liter enclosure. Engine. 2006. When the second-generation Audi TT was launched back in 2006, it was offered with a choice of three engines 1.8 TFSI, 2.0 TFSI, and 3.2 V6 Quattro, carried over from the previous generation. The 1.8 TFSI engine was initially offered only on the German market, but then became available in other parts of Europe in 2009. This engine produces a total of 158 HP at 4,500 to 6,200 revolutions per minute and a peak torque of 184 pound-feet at 1,500 to 4,500 revolutions per minute. The most famous engine of the TT family was the 2.0 TFSI, that is, before it got dropped in 2010. It delivered a total of 200 HP between 5,100 and 6,000 revolutions per minute and a peak torque of 207 feet, LBS at 1,800 revolutions per minute. This engine sprinted the car from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 6.4 seconds. For those who still loved the first generation TT, Audi continued to offer a 3.2 liter V6 engine with an output of 247 HP at 6,300 revolutions per minute and a peak torque of 236 pound feet at 2,500 to 3,000 revolutions per minute. This engine could have been combined with S Tronic dual clutch gearbox and Quattro drive. When equipped with the S-Tronic, the combination could sprint the car from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 5.7 seconds with S-Tronic. The V6 was also dropped in 2010. 2008 In 2008, Audi brought out the TT with two new engines, a 211 HP 2.0 TFSI, currently the only engine available for the US market, and a 2.0 TDI Quattro, available only for the European market. 
The new 2.0 TFSI turbocharged engine features direct injection technology and delivers a total of 211 HP between 4,300 to 6,000 revolutions per minute and 265 pound-feet of torque between 1,600 and 4,200 revolutions per minute. The new diesel engine delivers a total of 170 HP and 258.15 pound-feet of torque but also offers a fuel economy of 44.38 mpg on the coupe and 42.77 mpg on the Roadster. Don't be surprised to hear that this engine is the most appreciated on the European market. 2.0 TFSI Engine Facts Type 2.0 liter turbocharged, inline 4 cylinder, spark ignition engine with TFSI direct injection, 4 valves per cylinder, double overhead camshafts, DOHC, turbocharger with intercooler. Horsepower 211 horsepower at 4,300 to 6,000 revolutions per minute. Torque 258 pound feet at 1,600 to 4,200 revolutions per minute. Transmission, 6-speed dual-clutch gearbox with electro-hydraulic control. 0 to 60 miles per hour sprint time, 5.3 seconds coupe, 5.6 seconds roadster. 1 quarter mile, 14.1 seconds. Top speed, electronically limited to 130 miles per hour, 209 kilometers per hour for North America. Fuel consumption city, 18 mpg. Fuel Consumption Highway, 25 mpg Fuel Consumption Combined, 20 mpg Brakes Service Brake, Dual Circuit Brake System with Diagonal Split, ESP, Hydraulic Brake Assistant, Front Disc Brakes Ventilated Front Size, 12.3 by 1.0 in Rear Size, 11.3 by 0.5 in Parking brake, mechanically actuated at the rear wheels. Prices. Options. Competition. The Audi TT originally declared war on the Nissan 370Z. According to Nissan, their model is far better than the TT, it's cheaper, more powerful, and faster. This all might be true, but we find the TT to be a bit more elegant, even if many consider the 370Z a better looking car. The Roadster version of the TT also has another powerful competitor on the market, the BMW Z4 Roadster. In its SDR IVE 28i version, the Z4 delivers a total of 240 HP and 260 pound feet of torque at just 1,250 revolutions per minute. The extra power however will cost customers, though. It has a base price of $48,650. Love it elegant exterior nice evolution sporty character. Leave it interior room as a problem only one engine for USA. If you liked this video, please share your thoughts in the comments below and don't forget to hit the subscribe button.